Hi everybody, this is Connie. Thanks for listening to us today. I wanted to show you just a few things that we have here that's new on the website. Uh, first of all, we've got some lovely amethyst that's from Brazil. Amethyst, as you know, is one of the stones that I just, I dearly love. It's all over the store. It's all about transmuting energy into a higher form. It's a very spiritual stone. Um, all about connecting with the divine masters. Um, just lovely. Also, there's some citrine, which is, this is heat treated, but there are some beautiful pieces in this, and some of these actually have, look like little flowers. They're beautiful. Um, this is a Nondolite from India. This is an amazing, amazing crystal. And actually, you can take, I call these wands, but you can take the wand and take a flat piece and these you can actually use for kundalini activation and take one in each hand and run them up and down the body and they just make you feel very blissful <laughs> it's very incredible I think a lot of you would very be uh, really interested in that and this is not new but um, I just wanted to bring it to people's attention this is amethyst from India this is no longer available they actually put a road through about a year and a half ago and it pretty much crushed the pocket that was left there um, and it just has a really really sweet energy to it it's just unbelievable just wanted to share that with people that love amethyst also heat treated citrine right here but this is exceptional and it really has a nice or really good feeling to it the color is exceptional and then there's some natural citrine. This is from uh, Madagascar. It is polished, but this is in its natural form. It hasn't been heat treated. That's very nice. And then also Super 7. Uh, have a really one nice large piece of Super 7. This is an incredible stone. Very spiritual. All about taking the planet and everyone on the planet into ascension. It's working for us and with us and is a stone of great service. It's a stone that is beneficial to everyone. Put it in earth grids. Uh, use it for personal healing. To use for, um, well, just for everything. It is very amazing. Very amazing. It's all about being of service. And then also... I'm just really into blue stones this month. Uh, blue topaz, all about communication, clear communication. It actually is a stone that helps you to learn and, and remember it. It connects you. It, it makes that knowledge. It brings knowledge to you and helps you to learn and remember that. Um, aquamarine this aquamarine is exceptional color and it actually has if you look there's some dark places and that's lithium that's in there so aquamarine is all about clear communication also the lithium is also very calming um, that's a really nice combination to have it really makes um it's a very pleasant stone <laughs> very nice little blue obsidian still all about the blue um these are also good, you know, for clear communication. I just am into blues right now. And this is a blue-green tourmaline. These are very nice. Um, don't see this very often. And it actually has some rubellite. If you look, there's little veins of rubellite that's going through there. So that's pretty interesting, too. Um, also over here we have, this is called Rose Amethyst, and it's from Brazil. If you get down and look at it, I don't know if you can get real close, but it's actually very intricate, um, beautiful little clusters. Um, just exceptional. I just love these. The back sides of them, too, have a lot that comes off of them. Now, they're not as pretty as the front, but you do have little crystals, too. That's just a really neat piece. I don't have those up yet, but there's actually a few larger pieces, and there'll be several of the small pieces that'll be on the website, hopefully within about a week. And also, we just got some more shungite in, so we have plenty of pendants and also some smaller spheres that are available. Um, a lot of different things. The bracelets, you know, those are always really good for EMFs. When I fly, I put the bracelets, I always put one on each wrist and one on each ankle. Very beneficial for that. It's kind of like a wonder stone. 
um, the Super 7 calves. I didn't mention those. These are incredible too. Here's the large piece on the Super 7. The calves are just exceptional. I don't know if you can, how well that shows up like that. But um, very, very nice. I actually will use the Super 7 and I use calves in grids. Uh, a lot of people just like to put them in, you know, make pendants and things out of them, but I like to use them in grids and they're very good for earth grids especially since the Super 7 is all about this um, awakening of our consciousness and the ascension process. I find that that's a, a very beneficial one to use in grids for Mother Earth and to just to share our energy and love with that. So um, I think that's about it. I want to say thank you for listening to this, and you can visit us at uh, pointsoflight.net. So thank you very much. Have fun. Bye.